is a New Year's themed makeup. So this is sort of a more glamorous glittery makeup look maybe with a red lip. I'm not really sure right now but this is going to be something which is New Year's Eve appropriate maybe if you're going out at night if you have some plans at home if you're just gonna see your friends going out with your boyfriend husband family anyone so this is um, a look which I would probably wear on New Year's Eve as usual all the products are gonna be listed in the description box so make sure you check it out if there are going to be any limited edition products which I'm going to use which I know that there are then the alternatives to those will also be listed in the description box so without further ado let's just get right into it so guys my eyelids are already primed I use my Urban Decay primer potion for that and now I'm gonna go in with a setting powder to set my crease area. I'm going to take a Zoeva 234 Luxe Smoky Shader Brush. This is this. And I'm gonna pick some of this shade right here, Buttery, which is just a matte cream shade. And I'm just going to take it onto this brush and set my crease area just a little bit. I have hooded eyes, I need to do it to like in order for the colors to show on my eyelids. So now using a 228 Lux crease brush from Zoeva, I'm just going to dip into a I'm going to dip into my bronzer from Kiko and I'm just going to take a little bit of it onto the brush and I'm just gonna start working it into my crease area. I'm not really going to drag it all the way up. I'm going to keep it quite concentrated into this area right here. Um, using the same brush as before, I'm going to jump into my sleek bronze block in the shade dark. And I'm going to dip my brush into this dark brown right here. I'm just going to take a little bit of it onto the brush and I'm just going to apply it into my crease again, this time a little more precisely. And now I'm going to go into an eye base for my glitter eyeshadow and I'm going to use NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in the shade Night Chevalier. I think that's what how you pronounce it, I'm not sure. So it is just a very beautiful sort of a black based olive color. I mean not really olive but it has sort of a golden olive uh, glitter into it. And I'm just going to apply it everywhere onto my eyelid from the corner to the inner corner. And now taking a 233 cream shader brush by Zoeva and I'm just going to pat this color um, onto the lid a little bit sort of blending it as I go and now taking a 223 petite eye blender I'm just going to blend out any of the harsh edges which um, this eyeshadow has left So now that my eye base is on, I'm going to go in with a glitter glue. I'm going to use the NYX glitter primer right here and I'm going to take a very very small quantity of it. I'm just going to apply this glitter primer everywhere that I have put the eye base. So I'm literally going to cover the eye base with a thin layer of this glitter primer. Now taking 237 detail shader brush by Zoeva, I'm just going to I'm just going to pick the shade Lithium, which is this one right here. And this is from the Moonjo's palette by the way. And I'm just going to load it up onto my brush to have off the excess and then just press it over the eyelid. I think I need to use my fingers. Just going to take it on my fingers and oh okay. Wow. This looks so pretty. I'm just pressing it into the skin with my 
um, with using my fingers. Oh my god, this color is so pretty. Now grabbing a 231 Lux Petite crease, I'm going to pick up this dark brown shade again and I'm just going to run it very very precisely into my crease uh, just to blend out any harsh lines that my cream base or the glitter eyeshadow has left. A little bit on the outer V as well and now taking a 228 I'm just going to blend any of the darker colors with the transition shade I'm just going to run it one last time along my crease So I'm really happy with how it's looking right now. I think it needs just a little something into the outer V of the eye. Uh, so I'm going to grab some hot chocolate, which is this dark uh, brown shade. I'm going to pick it up on a 231 again. And I'm just going to darken out my outer V with this shade. Oh yes. my lid work is complete and now I'm gonna go and work on my lower lash line uh, so for that I'm taking this 231 again and with the hot chocolate shade which is already on it I'm just going to run it very close to my lashes I'm not going to drag it all the way inside I'm going to stop just as I'm going to like just over here and I'm also going to connect it with the outer V of my eyelid and now taking a 230 Lux pencil brush I'm just going to take some of that bronzer shade right here and I'm going to run it really really close to the hot chocolate shade I'm just going to run it really really close to it um, sort of just blending out the harsh lines So now taking the 317 wing liner brush, I'm just going to dip it into the shade hot chocolate again And I'm just going to run it really close to my upper lash line And now for my inner third of the eye and the inner corners, I'm just going to go with this glitter liner I'd call it from Savannah Colors and I'm just going to apply it on to my inner corner of the eye and a little bit onto my inner third of the eye and now taking the 234 Lux Smoky Shader I'm just going to blend this glitter into my inner third of the eye So to just add a little bit of more depth into this look, I'm going to go in with a black eyeliner pencil and I'm just going to line my waterline, upper and lower both. So I have lined my upper and lower waterlines and now I'm going to go in with a mascara and I'm going to use the L'Oreal Fall Slash Superstar Mascara because Literally, this is like my second most favorite mascara after the Kiko one. And now using this 222 all over shader brush, I'm just going to pick the shade buttery again. And I'm just going to highlight my brow bone like very very slightly and the eye look is complete 
Now for the lips, I'm gonna go in with the Smashbox Always On Liquid Lipstick in the shade Boss, which was made in collaboration with my most favorite YouTuber of all times, who is Lily Sink. So I'm just going to apply it on my lips. Okay. It is sort of a deep red. Uh, I'm sorry guys, my camera stopped recording suddenly, so I just lost some footage. So what I did now um, after I applied my lipstick was that I went in with this Ofra's long lasting liquid lipstick in the shade Havana Nights and I just applied it onto the inner corner of my lip. I thought that lipstick was a little too bright for my personal liking with this look. So I wanted something to make it a little dark. So I use this lipstick, which is also one of my most favorite lipstick of all time. So now guys, the look is complete. Um, if you want, you can apply some blush with it. I personally don't think that I need to apply any sort of blush with it because then I'd have a lot going on onto my face, which I don't want. I really want my eyes and my lips to, uh, to really stand out. And so guys, this is the finished look. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. As usual, the product list will be in the description box, so make sure you check it out. Um, and please follow me on my social media, the links are also in the description box. I hope you're gonna have a great New Year's Eve. Please go out, celebrate with your family and friends, or I mean, just do what you love to do. It's like the last night of this year. I hope the coming year brings you a lot of joy and happiness and a lot of success. Happy New Year you guys and if you like this video then please like, share and subscribe to my channel and I hope you're gonna have a great day ahead. Bye!